to my enemy, don't even feel it matter. Word to my slam, I can make it happen. Yeah. Yeah, I ride dirty with the whip clean, and I've been doing this since I was 16. Look at this, be softer than whipped cream. Yeah, they sleep, they live in the big dream. Well, let me tell you how real dough is. Now, when I first signed with Dodo and them, like I said, when we went to the to the to the um to the lawyer's office and we signed, after we signed, we all went out to eat, everything was cool, boom, we left. I mean it was like um boy, them just sent Brick and them their first portion of money, and I think it was like four hundred thousand or something like that. I had signed, my girl's pregnant, I'm still hustling. And uh, I remember Marcelo pulling up. He's like, what's up? I'm going by Hakeem. Hakeem was out the Iverbill. We recorded my album by Hakeem. He said, we're going by Hakeem. You ready? And I'm like, I'm not ready. I had just scored. I'm like, I'm not ready. He's like, come on, man. Let's roll. I'm like, man, Shorty got to eat. You hear me? <laughs> Hit them, looking, at, looking at the packs. You hear me? He looked. He was like, that's what's up. <laughs> pulled off. I could tell the way he pulled off. He was, he was, that brick was mad, like on some shit. So he went back and told Dodo. So later on that next day, I'm out hustling. He come pull up. Dodo like, Tano. He used to call me Tano. I was like, Tano, come get in the truck. I get in the back. And he like, you still want to be a tough guy, bro? You know? You not happy? You know you not happy yet? And I'm like, my, my girl, like five months pregnant. Like, I'm not saying I don't want to be tough guys, but damn, son, I'm just like, you know, I'm just trying to figure out what to do next. I'm out here, wooty wooty woo. He said, give me my briefcase. And I could see, I could hear the pop, 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 pop. He fold that <laughs> up. He fold that up. He gave me a yellow check. He said, that shit Toe gave you? Make sure you give it back to him. I'm like, I got you, big bro. I didn't even look at the check. I came out the truck. I closed that. I, you know, I looked at that motherfucker. That was like 20. I'm like, oh, this <laughs> year. <laughs> Get on the block every day, daily. I wasn't getting that. He pull up in the Rover. Dodo and Marcelo, they pull up in the Rover, right? He was like, what you doing? I'm like, nothing. He said, come outside. I'm like, I'm already outside. He said, come around the corner. I got, I got, I'm still on the cool. You know what I'm saying? You, you feel me? I'm still, I can't stop. You know, you can't give the shit back. You know what I'm saying? You know, he said something like, yeah, to get that shit back to toe and make sure. I'm like, like. You don't, that ain't how the game works. I got it. I got to get off it. I even put that in the verse. What I was going to do, let this coat go bad? You know what I'm saying? You know, so I, you know, so that's, you know, that's, that's the level I was on. I was like, let me just down the rest of this little two and a quarter, bitch. I'm, I'm out. I got my 20. I, I'm met a stone and quarter. You know, I'm slinging them. You hear me? So, um, I got buku slabs in my mouth or whatever. So, boom, he's like, get in. I'm like, all right. I could barely talk. You know what I'm saying? You dig? So, uh, Brick looking at me, he looking over the back seat. He said, huh, the bitch give me the box, the little black velvet boxes in plastic. I slide that to the plastic, you know what I'm saying? I pop that bitch open, it's a tough guy emblem, you heard me, with the Cuban link chain. And it's just like separate, you know what I'm saying? He's like, I'm like, what? So I can't really say nothing. So I take the own, right? And you know those windbreaker ass pants you know the nike ass pants yeah. i put the rocks on. i put the shit right here on my lap so i could talk to him i'm telling him oh this fire i put the chain on he's like all right be ready to go to the studio later i'm like all right cool boom i get out the truck i'm going by my business boop, 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 boop. right this about two months later two months later after this incident two months later we sitting in the studio Everybody having fun. And so I'm getting ready to record. Dodo getting ready to come in there. And Marcelo say, I'm, I'm, I, I must have said a drug verse or some shit. And then Marcelo say, shit, lucky Dodo ain't kill you. Bitch. And I'm like, what is you talking about? You just out the blue. What is you talking about? He said, bitch, you know when, um, when you got the chain shit? I said, when, when come, you know, a few months ago? He was like, yeah. He said, bitch, we riding down two lane. We soon we get to two lane and broad, they got two police cars, one one behind each other, they sit next to each other. Dodo and that bitch, we listening to my album. Dodo, you know, he stay with the little buck. You know, he, he got a name, you know his face, Dodo looking at the rover, he looking at the going, on. You know, cause you know we got money. He looking at them booting them up on some shit. He said, we in that jamming. He said everything cool. He said we go to the house and we go to 
get something out the back of the truck, and bitch, they got crack all over the floor of the back seat. Oh, shit. They got crack all over the floor of the back seat. And I'm like, are you kidding me? And then it hit me. Boom, 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 boom. I'm like, I got so excited behind that chain, them slippery ass pants, that crack claims clean off my pants in the backseat of this man truck, and I and he and I was supposed to get his shit back to him. Back back to two. Out of all that time that passed, my heart gonna beat instantly. I'm sober. It ain't fun in the studio no more. I'm I don't give a fuck can say what they want, bitch. I'm shook. Cause I'm like, damn, bitch, maybe this Still waiting to knock my shit behind this. You know what I'm saying? You know, in my mind, that was a big up, homie. Doe is like a seven-time loser, capital murder. Doe trying to change his life. He done told me to get a man to crack back. I ain't do none of that. You hear me? Dodo come walk in the room. And I'm just eerily quiet. Tano, what's wrong with you? I'm like, nothing. You know what I'm saying? And my son said, nah, he shook. He shook. <laughs> I told that about that shit with that crack. He said, I told that shit about that leaving that shit in the back of the truck. And that bitch don't look. He said, why you say something? He said, yeah, I was burnt with you. I was burnt. He said, we all next to the police booting him. Up. All the bitch had to do was hit them lights. You got $200 worth of crack on the back seat on the floor. He was like, bro. I'm like, I said, why you ain't tell me nothing? He said, man, because you was excited with the chain shit. I already know who do, who do, who do. Ain't nothing happen, God good. Bro, I was like, it's wow. Like a big, dog yeah, a real big, big dog. Real. And that just did something to me when it come to him. And I always, always for the rest of my life, I don't know what that did in this past, all the way and everything that he done. But for me, it was a blessing. Yeah, Tough yeah. Guys was a blessing. Dodo was a blessing. Marcella was a blessing. Dipping through New Orleans on a Cali. With two thirty eight like I'm from Dallas. I'm separated from the street, but still married. So if the shit pop off, I'm dirty Harry. Let's go, let's go. Tell my enemies only my family matters. Word to a slam, I can make it happen. Yeah. Yeah, I ride dirty with the whip clean. And I've been doing this since I was sixteen. Be softer than whipped cream. Yeah, they sleep, they live in the big dream. He always creates an avenue for himself. If you look at Marcelo's track record. Have been have done music with a lot of people. He's featured on a lot of albums. He's fam game, and he had a very huge part of currency uh, success. Uh, him getting on Soldier Slim album that was a Marcelo move. Um, him to me, I think getting as chummy chummy as he did with Vol in how the relationship, how everybody just the whole mechanics. You know, this was also a spin off of. The Magnolia and Cali are working together. Marcelo just was a very instrumental tool when it came to a lot of uh, things happening. But I just don't think that, you know, he just was able to capitalize on his shit for himself. You know what I'm saying? You know, sometimes people work better helping others than they do themselves. Mm -hmm.